Well, like so many things, they had to take two years off because of the pandemic, but it is back. The Friends of the Symphony 60th Annual National Lime Symphony Orchestra Young Artist Competition. And to tell us more about it today, to my immediate left, we have Kim Shanahan, and we have to her left, Tammy Sanford, and we're at the Friends of the Symphony. So thanks for coming today, ladies. Thank, Thank you. you. Okay, so it's exciting, right, Kim? I mean, you're back, and now yes. we've got a competition. Finally. So tell us about the competition this year. Uh, the competition this year is going to be voice and strings. Uh, this will be our 60th, so it's really, really a big deal. We pride ourselves on attracting wonderfully talented musicians from some of the top conservatories in the country. We have uh, someone coming from Juilliard, um, yeah. Carnegie Mellon, uh, also people who have competed not only within the U.S. with top operas because we have voice this year mm -hmm. but also outside of the u.s and um received you know top honors and medals and they come from a variety of countries too because they come here to the u.s to study at these conservatories oh sure all right and i mean you do find a wonderful talents because they in the past winners have come back and performed with the orchestra right that's the primary reason i think they like to come to the competition because they're looking for that experience of performing with an orchestra in the past 20 years, we've had probably 18 of our finalists perform with the orchestra, and it's just some amazing talent. And to get to go to a free concert this Saturday and see this kind of talent before they hit the big time is um, a great opportunity for the community. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Tammy, let's talk about that concert because it is free. and. Gosh, we're going to see some great performances, aren't we? Yeah, I want to say, first of all, it's free because of the generosity of so many of our donors, particularly the Friends of the Symphony. We have donations from $25 on up, and it's really, every year they come back and they want to support it. They want to support the arts as well as to support these kids who are in school for a long time and train and are passionate about what they're doing. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, it is free. It is going to be Saturday evening, April the 2nd, 7.30 p.m., we are back at OSU Lima, the Martha Farmer Theater in Reed Hall. It is free. It is a cheap date for someone. <laughs> it's great if you have young kids that are interested in music to bring those kids that night so they can see these performers. And um, it's actually the finalist competition. So we take the top two from each category during the day. They perform and we find out then, they're all winners, they perform who's first and second receive cash awards. Uh -huh. All right. I guess I didn't realize that, that, that they it, don't know yet then the top awards until that concert. They huh? just know they're in the top two and then they oh. compete that night. So it's so fun. The audience actually becomes like a judge for them. Oh, I and guess. we see it. And we'll then have 35 performing this Saturday during the day Ooh. to audition for a spot, to eight positions that evening. Mm -hmm. You it's bring amazing. judges in for that. I mean, that, yes. that must be yes. a tough thing to do to judge. We've got wonderful judges this year um, with very strong backgrounds in adjudicating. So. Um, yeah, she works so doing. hard to get people to come. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, and she has great people in place. Uh huh. Yeah, Thank I you. bet. Yeah. Well, I mean, and as you said, the, you know, people like to sign up because this is an opportunity for them. Yes, it's it, it's something that they can put on their resume that it's important to them. I mean, they may have been studying for years. They may have won a lot of awards, but ob obviously the end goal is to perform with orchestras mm -hmm. so they want to get their foot in the door right yeah and lime symphony orchestra friends you guys are providing that foot 60 years are you guys 60. surprised that you know that wow you know it's, it's really been happening it's, and it's so popular it's, 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 since i was going through like the history and some of the paperwork and it looks like it would start around uh we started doing this around 1960 so yeah it's it's been a long Right. And, Wonderful and, we, road. and we do have a reception that night following that concert that again is free okay. and um, we're just going to have some sweets out and we're going to celebrate our 60th year but you get to mingle with these incredible students so they come off the stage and then they're out there and you can talk to them mm -hmm. and like you said you never know they might be performing with somebody big along with the symphony orchestra too absolutely yeah. very exciting all right that is this saturday at the ohio state martha farmer theater and it's at the ohio state campus 7 30. Yes. thank you guys for coming thank today you. Of you. What a great we thing hope to see everyone about. there yeah exactly all right so don't go away we'll look at the weather forecast next